great grand morning, my friends. Welcome to Blanco Bronco Adventures. If you're new here, my name's Derek. And I'm Monica. This is my beautiful wife, Monica. The mother of three awesome children that we don't have in the back seat right now because we are at Matt's Off Road. Off Road Games. Off Road Games. I wanted to call it Record Games because that's what it was last year, but now it is the Off Road Games. Look, we're official. You know, got the pass. Entrance parking. But here's the deal. We came here with no specific agenda in mind other than we want to help Matt's Off-Road Recovery just with things. So, Hefe, you know, you remember Hefe. He's got the Bronco that we worked on about last year. A year Time ago. Time flies. Yeah. It's crazy. Anyway, I called him up and I was like, Hefe, what do we need to do? And he's like, you'll be the mule to haul things back and forth. And I says, no, we're not the mule. We're a Bronco. So we're bronco and things back and forth. This morning, we got the honor to bring the owner of Barnes four-wheel drive. As these YouTubers are participating in this event, they have to stop along the trail and participate in activities. Challenges. Challenges. Tricky. Well, they're gonna be having to replace a spare down there. Then, Hefe was like, hey, we had a couple guys call out sick due to wind. Yeah, it's, it's windy. You can probably see the Bronco moving yeah, right now. Yeah, it's rough. So there's probably going to be a lot of like music, you know, jamming this one up or voiceovers. I'll be honest with you because you don't want to hear that, you know, <laughs> just it doesn't sound good. So we, we strive for better quality. Anyway, we get the opportunity to partake in one of those activities. YouTubers make it big, and what's the first thing they do? They buy a plane they or a helicopter. They become aviators. I don't know why. Avia you got aviator glasses, so we're practically there. Is there? No, yeah. we're not. We don't have no. We have Bronco. The fact of the matter is, unless my Bronco grows wings and can fly, I, I have no... I, I like to stay on the ground. <laughs> we're going to try to get set up in the wind. We've got some time to kill, because this morning they're doing triple sevens, and then coming up, double Sammy. Mm -hmm. You, these trails, they're legit. So, it's so what we're gonna do for now. We're parked where we need to be. We're gonna meander, me meander. We're gonna mosey down the trail. That's what I'm trying to spit out and get you some live action of these YouTubers in tricky situations. One YouTuber is a professional driver off road. The other one, not at all experienced. This is gonna be awesome. Interesting. I, I wish they would have put a Bronco in here because Broncos like to pick up a wheel, you know? Like Make this. It. We did this this morning. Look at this. It is is bad. It, it was real early, but... We're in a hurry. We were in a hurry. We had royalty to deliver back and forth here at the off-road game. So we're starting to get a crowd showing up. We're going to stay planted here, and live action is coming right now. This is crazy. I don't know if you'll be able to hear because of the wind, but worth a try. This is such a cool idea for a competition. Unexperienced, with the experienced, do challenges along the way. It's what off-roading is about. Teamwork, you know, makes things work. 
That's what they say. The, the wind's dying down a scotch. Not enough, but a little. We'll take that because now it's warm. <sighs> I'm like a mile away from the R checkpoint. The Bronco's like, I don't, I don't know. The fact of the matter is, I gotta, I gotta get back to the top. So change of plans. Wow. I look like I'm old. Huh. Anyway, it is dirty out here. The wind is real. Sandy dust. Really cold. I got, got a grit in my teeth. Anyway. Canceled the airplanes. Why? Too windy. Windy. Wouldn't make sense. You're gonna throw them, it just, they're made out of what? Poster, poster board, board or something yeah. is what their plan was, but still, it just, who knows where it goes. So we don't wanna leave trash around, we wanna pick trash up. So, canceled that. Everybody just ran the chute. Now, we gotta make it all the way back down yep. there. How does this work with the depths here? Oh, right there. That water. <laughs> Down there is where the record poles are gonna be. I don't know what time. Three. That starts three. Yep. We got a trek ahead of us. Yep. Watching all these people, they're here for a good time. All the participants, you know, it's just worth the trip to come out here. Plus, looking at all these other built rigs, you know, it gives me ideas. Um, I We need to build an actual crawler. Yeah. The Bronco's cool. But I want something that if it flips on its side, oh well. You I know? won't flinch as bad. Yeah, you know, we'd still make payments on yeah. this thing. It just, it wouldn't make all the sense until it's paid off, right? Even then. Yeah. I don't know, it's hard to say. Anyway, been talking to some people and just, you know, brainstorming. What leftover parts do we have from all the projects? Well, that's what we're gonna just put together. I don't know. We'll come up with something, but now let's go watch some wrecker poles on the mm -hmm. beach and eat some more sand while we're down there yeah. it, it seems like that's the trend here so looks like everybody's loading up in the shuttle and uh heading out go under the water oh see i just how do you the accuracy there's some people that are really good at this there it is <laughs> we'll see you down there
My friends oh filthy dirty blink it out yeah don't get it in your eyes it's already there day number one at matt's off-road recovery off-road games, off -road games. <laughs> it's been a long day i want to call it the record games it just seems so natural we uh had a great lunch watched the record poles mm -hmm. i believe tomorrow is like all the big dogs doing the record poles so you got matt will be out there and rory and all the guys that actually do this for a living and what a great event you know put this on your calendar yeah yeah I, I just hope it's fun next year they just need to turn off the wind yeah you know we asked them we're like hey turn it down and they said we can't yeah. i think that they're fibbing <laughs> but that's just me we were able to attend the vendor show got sucked in to all the goods yeah we've been here for like three hours spent our mortgage essentially <laughs> Look at what we got though. I am impressed with Factor 55 and Warren Winch. You guys need some good advice. You have questions. You need good reading this. material. Read this. Go to those guys. I, I mean, we spent the last like nine hours talking because it just kept, you know, look at this hook. Yeah. 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 And, and, yeah. wait for it. We got a new Fairly. Okay. Why? 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 Because I I felt like I needed this. <laughs> we learned a lot. We powder coated the fair lead on our Bronco. Why? Make it look cool. There goes Tom Tom. Make it look cool, you know? Well, guess what? You powder coat on stuff, powder coat's thick. It looks cool, looks nice. And now our winch line is Yeah. It's all frayed. It's a little sad. Needs replaced. So that's on the docket. Got that ordered. Coming soon. Um all we, you know, it was just little things like that for recovery and, you know, this whole off-roading that some of those things you just don't think of, they had the knowledge and There's information. There's a lot to learn. A ton to learn. So we got some goods. You'll see that in videos and all the stuff, you know, we'll keep you informed. But look at this. They said that this hook was blemished, so they gave us a deal on it. It's too dark. Yeah, that's the blemish. They take pride in all their products to make sure they are consistent. I just hold this right in front of your face the Thanks, whole right. time. Yep. Oh, there you go. <laughs> they take pride in all their products being consistent and just really high quality. Well, this one's a little too dark. I got a deal. It's great. You know, that's why I was like, give me a me. fair lead and more soft shackles and all the goods. Anyway, get off your couch. It's time to create an adventure and it's time for us to shower. Yeah. We'll see you tomorrow. I got the grit in my teeth. True grit. True grit. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow, day number two at the off-road games. Rock to Rock to Adventures.